Hey dear friends, welcome back to Java tutorial. Uh, in this episode, I will show you how you can work with file. And please subscribe to my channel youtube.com slash burna in this channel please subscribe so let's get started so let's get started with file uh, you can work with file with uh, file class okay as you can see now I'm working with file uh, as you can see there is four constructor method with uh, uh, in file class okay and a string and URL uh, and file and a string child uh, also a string parent and child and so on so let's get started with uh, for example uh, in this directory uh, for example, in this directory, uh, a file, file one.txt. Okay, like this. Now you have a file. Okay, you have a file. Uh, you <coughs> now you can check the file. If file uh, is file or exists, if exists, okay if does not exist so you can create new file okay you can create new file like this but this need uh, an i exception we add it okay so else if file exists then then uh, what should we do uh, before this uh, let's let's run our uh, app now as you can see we doesn't have any file in our directory okay uh, we don't have any file in our directory so let's run oh yes as you can see now file created as you can see if i open it this here is here is a file okay file one dot txt so I can see there is any file let's refresh wow there is no refresh so what's up what's up uh, but there should be uh, 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 there uh, should uh, our file should create. Uh, I want to open the directory, the document in NetBeans project. Okay, and app. As you can see, the file does not exist. Okay. What's the problem? So let's see actually what is the problem why why the file is not created we uh, checked the file a file exists oh a file exists then here the well land uh, we should we should put that here a file exists so file exists a message for example file exists okay file <coughs> exists otherwise otherwise you can create a new file okay now let's run our application this will this will create file now if we check here oh yes now a file created but this file is empty so a file exists we can write something in our in our file file dot uh, you can write uh, something okay oh there, there, there is not right okay as you can see here is more 
as you can see there is less than some okay there is more method okay so that so this is great so now if, if I run again uh, file file exists so this time this message will run because file is exist okay if file is not exist this file will create it so let's write something to our, to our file <clears throat> so we can write by file writer okay by file writer writer is equal to a uh, new file writer okay you as you can see here file writer have five constructor method uh, with a file parameter with a file uh, descriptor with a sync with a file and boolean append okay and so on so let's create this file oh that's okay now let's write something writer dot write okay you can write some string hello how are you this file will write it okay now if we check our file there is nothing why what's up what's the problem okay what's the problem why this can't write to our file so actually so this right as you can see uh, this writer writer as you can see public void write by exception writes a string asyn writes okay there is nothing else so actually what's the problem uh, what's the problem so write writer there is all the method uh, is string with init of and len okay of offset from which to start writing character and len number of character to write so I want to write something hey dear friends okay so but why this file is there is not write it and there is nothing write it okay so this tell us that file write but the file is not right so so actually what's the problem uh, file writer so so this file maybe is not writable uh, so you can you can uh, you can cut this and check again okay let's check again uh, file is Uh, is file is uh, right so there is we have can write this check can write test whether the application can write can modify the file denoted abstract part name let's check it okay Here is yes, and the else no. Let's check. 
Yes, file we can write. Okay. Uh, tell us yes, you can write. Can write. So let's clean this. <laughs> file that can write yes file can write okay let's ch check can write this also is true can write can write but exists yes exists <coughs> you can get the absolute part of your file as you can see this is the absolute part of our file and get absolute part get absolute file both are the same get absolute part and get absolute file okay also canonical part it also works the same canonical file also you have canonical part okay get absolute part get absolute file get canonical part get canonical file okay this all is get free space as you can see this is the free space of the directory So this all is uh, set read only, set right table, set right table, we can pass true, okay, then we can write something, let's check again, let's check again, there is nothing, why, so Want to remove this right now? That is actually right table set. As you can see, set exit table, uh, rename to MKDIRs, can make a directory, uh, I can do a file list, okay, land. This heading is absolute. Get total space. Get parent. As you can see, this is get name. We will return actually the file name. As you can see, file name is file1.txt. And also, you can get the parent name. This will return the directory. It is up, it is null, parent is actually null. Okay, the get parent file, get part, get total space, get it. This will return the path of the file. Okay, so. So also this was of the video. Yes, I want to make a new file. I want to make this dir. You can make a directory, okay? Di dir for example 
for example let's make the ir.mkdir as you can see it makes a dir here okay now you can check it if dir is is directory as directory oh you just as directory is absolute as directory is file is not file hidden is not hidden is directory is well written true okay as you can see it is directory so that's good but why you cannot write a file oh yes and now I know what is actually we write some file when a file can write that we flush the file okay this will write ah yes when we flush the file because when we write this will go to in a uh, buffer uh, setting and when you flush that file will write okay now if i clean this if i run again that will not write also write the, well, as you can see flash flashes the stream okay flashes the stream clues what does clues closes the stream flashing it first as you can see clues first first make it uh, flash then close once the stream has been closed for the write or flash invocation will cast an i exception to be turned closing previously closed stream has no offer so this will also work nice because as you can see but if i run again this it will rewrite as you can see it will rewrite but if i put here a true value and that will append the file okay as you can see it append our file okay now if i if i make it this a backslash in yeah as you can see now if i run again it works nice okay and every time i run it appends the file so this is nice as uh, also you can write a json file for example For example, so because of no longer the video, I want to stop this video and see you in the next video. Goodbye, and do not forget to subscribe my channel.